From the sun's rays to the polar ice caps, from the deepest oceans to the vast tropical forests, the Earth's climate is a complex and dynamic system. That's why measuring changes to it and understanding what's driving them is important and challenging which is why every six years the United Nations brings together hundreds of climate scientists. This is the most comprehensive international review of the climate science and what these reports have done is to provide increasingly compelling evidence about the scale of the changes that human activity such as burning fossil fuels and deforestation is having on the world's climate. The report's authors considered a mass of scientific research relating to climate change. More than 850 experts have been working on its 14 chapters. The document comes in at more than 2,000 pages, and the last revision received more than 30,000 comments from contributors. Its chapters focused on the atmosphere and clouds, on the oceans and sea levels. They also looked at climate models and considered projections for long and near-term change. The last report from the International Panel on Climate Change in 2007 concluded that climate change is occurring and that human activity, in particular the emission of greenhouse gases, was very likely to be the cause. But a small number of errors were used by sceptics to cast doubt on the report. They said it had overplayed warming predictions, sea level rise and the role played by greenhouse gases. The last UN report flagged up significant risks to a broad range of human and natural systems. This report is expected to build on that, taking in more scientific data to give the world's governments, businesses and citizens the best possible idea of what's happening to the earth and what's likely to happen in the years ahead. Tarek Basley, Al Jazeera.